Hi everyone, it's Dr. A, and in this video, we're going to investigate the screw home mechanism of the knee. Let's take a look at what's called the screw home mechanism of the knee. What this mechanism represents is that in order for the knee to move from a flexed position to a fully extended position, the knee must screw home, or in other words, rotate, so that the femur and tibia are properly aligned. So on the left side of the screen, let's imagine that we're considering someone seated with their knee flexed to 90 degrees. And while remaining in this seated position, they intend to fully extend their knee as shown on the right side of the screen. And based on the orthokinematic rule that would apply here, we would have the concave surface moving on the convex surface. And in this manner, the roll will occur in the direction of the action and the slide will occur in the same direction. So here, both the roll and slide are occurring in a forward direction. And to achieve alignment of the tibial and femoral condyles, the tibia will perform approximately 10 degrees of external rotation to achieve a fully extended position. We can refer to this rotation as the spin arthrokinematic movement. Now, if we were to have this individual return their leg to a flexed position from a fully extended position, the same orthokinematic rule would apply. We would have the concave surface moving on the convex surface. Now, in order for this to occur, the knee would have to unlock itself from its extended position. And to do this, the tibia would have to internally rotate. And this internal rotation is analogous to our spin arthrokinematic movement. And like before, the roll and slide arthrokinematic movements will occur in the same direction as the action. In this example, the roll and the slide are going to occur in a posterior direction. Well, thank you for watching this video. I hope it's been helpful. And if you have any questions, please let me know in the comments section below. And I'll look forward to connecting with you again in the next video.